Ugh. Will you stop trying to scare me Why I'm trying to record? How many times have I told you to not come into the recording booth when I'm trying to record audio? No, it's not funny. It's annoying. You're about the most annoying roommate ever. Please, please tell me why I let you talk me out of uh, having you exercised from my house. That's beside the point. I might love you now, but I didn't love you then. Especially when we first met. You were floating about the house like you own the joint. When you were living, you are not alive anymore. You know what? That is kind of true. Just because you're dead does not mean you can't own property. However, you can't maintain property or pay the taxes on the property or anything else. So therefore, you really can't own it because eventually it'd be taken away from you. Yeah, not so funny now, are we? No, I'm not mean. What it it is, is you're mad because I pointed out a fact. <sighs> what? Oh, so it is. I guess it's the, you know, I forgot to hit pause in this recording. Because someone tried to scare me. Oh, okay. Well, since you've interrupted my recording, I better hit pause on that. There we go. Since you interrupted my recording, and now you're just floating around bugging the hell out of me, what do you need? Sure. I understand that. I mean, you were alone for what? Hundred years? Two hundred years? Long ass time? Totally get it. That's all right. Come on. I'll go make lunch or something and you can sit with me and we do this weird thing I understand you can still smell food it's just weird when you're sitting near me while I'm eating trying to smell my food it's not like you can eat it Fine, fine, fine. I don't know. I was just probably going to make a bit of rice with an egg. Maybe some ramen with an egg. I don't know. I'm really craving eggs. I mean, you can, uh, I was going to go out and do some yard work and come float around and hang out with me. Or we could go and 
sit in my office. Why I write scripts? Maybe. Well, you know, how about this? I make a cup of chamomile lavender tea. That that's calms the both of us down. Clearly something's bothering. So let's make that tea. And then we can go watch some Netflix or something. Sound like a plan? Perfect. And when you're ready, you can tell me what's, you know, bothering you. Somehow I'm going to have to find a way to charm this booth so you can't enter it while I'm recording. <laughs> Seriously. That's how I keep the lights on, bro. You know, it's already hard enough to be being a struggling voice actor without a ghost roommate wreaking havoc on me. Don't make me call that exorcist. Nah, pff. get out of here with yourself. Come on, let's go have some tea and a chill.